Hey, brothers and sisters. So I wanted to share this prophecy podcast from Now the End Begins. It really caught my attention as a former Catholic who understands that the Eucharist is something far different than the Lord's Supper. And I truly understand the roots of Rome, uh, ecumenicalism, um, Rick Warren, just everything, how it all fits together to form the one world false religion. I wanted to play this uh, preview clip to the podcast from now the end begins and i encourage you to listen to it and check it out it definitely seems like um a prophetic fulfillment of everything that the bible talks about in the last days regarding not putting up with sound doctrine and living in deception in perilous times check it out here of the Prophecy News Podcast, a number of powerful forces are all converging at the same time, seemingly united in the same purpose, that being the outpouring of a spirit. But what spirit? In 1 John 4, 1, he says, Beloved, believe not every spirit, but try the spirits. Now, you have the Asbury Revival, which is still growing. You have the amazingly coincidental release of the movie Jesus Revolution. You have emergent church leaders supporting it. And you have the Catholic Church joining up with it. Man, that's a lot of moving parts. But wait, there's more. You also have the opening of the Abrahamic Family House, the headquarters of the One World Religion of Chrislam. And you have a little something that you're going to learn about today called Roman Catholic Charismatic Renewal. Did you know that Asbury University offers a daily Eucharist five times a week at noon? What's that you say? Well, it's the special sauce behind all of these events taking place before your very eyes right now. Today on the Prophecy News Podcast, we trace the Asbury outpouring right back to Mother Rome, showing you the vast amounts of money and power behind it and prove beyond the shadow of any doubt that this is the end times deception that the Bible warned you about.